Hello and welcome. Unlock the full potential of your virtual bass guitar in FL Studio with our comprehensive tutorial. Whether you're a seasoned producer or just starting, we've got pro-level tips to help you make your VST bass guitar sound as authentic as a live one. From slap bass to pitch bends, we'll cover it all. By the end of this tutorial, you'll be playing your virtual bass guitar in FL Studio like a pro. Like, follow, and subscribe to stay tuned for more music production tips and tutorials. Here are the pro tips and techniques. 1. Experiment with using multiple bass sounds to create a unique and massive bass tone. Blend different VSDs or samples to your liking. In this tutorial, I added the slap bass and electric bass guitars separately. 2. Learn the art of slap bass for that funky, percussive sound. Practice your timing to get that signature groove. Three, utilize the slide feature to smoothly transition between notes, mimicking the slide technique used on a Rio bass guitar. You can add these special notes by clicking here. If it's above, the bass note will slide up. The longer the note, the longer the slide duration. If the note is below a normal note, the bass sound will slide down. 4. You can also add expressiveness to your bass lines with pitch bends. Just add short slide notes that are either a semitone or a tone above or below a normal note. This will create subtle or dramatic bends for a dynamic performance. 5. Master the vibrato technique to add depth and emotion to your bass lines. This can be achieved by adding multiple short slide notes to a single normal note like you can see in this example. Control the speed and depth of the vibrato for a personalized touch. 6. Fine-tune your bass guitar sound with EQ and effects like compression, distortion, and reverb. Craft a tone that fits your track. The best VSD bass instruments come with preloaded effects that you can fine-tune to your liking. 7. Practice, practice, practice. Like any instrument, practice is key. Spend time refining your bass guitar skills and experimenting with different techniques. This brings us to the end of this tutorial. Like, follow, and subscribe to stay tuned for more music production tips and tutorials. Let's groove!